NFL Week 13 picks with Frogs Angels, Kick-Ass Club as I like to call it. Please join the Kick-Ass Club. But let's get into these picks. Thursday night football, Redskins at football. Cowboys. Yeah, Battle of the 5-6. and six. It's a good game, I guess. Not really. No. I no. mean, if you want a close game, it should be good. Redskins are pretty beat up. Cowboys are on the struggle bus. Who you guys got? I'm taking Captain Kirk. I think he's going to just like that. You know? Yeah. Like that? He's going to like that. Oh, they said like that. that like the, light a match or something? No, no, no. Light the, no, like you like that? <laughs> oh, I got you. I got you. Yeah, we're going with the skins as well. Uh, you know, Cowboys Why? suck. Oh! Uh, I think the Redskins have too many injuries. I don't know who's playing who's not playing this week, but they're pretty beat up. Mm. I think the Cowboys win at home in this Ooh. one in the Thursday night game. And to the next game, we have the Vikings, <clears throat> the Vikings at the Falcons. Uh, that's a good, that should be a good one. Falcons are starting to pick it up, and uh, the Vikings are on a seven-game win streak. Uh, I think I'm going to have to go with the uh, – I think Keenum's just rolling here. I think he has just absolutely just been on fuego, so I'm going to go with Atlanta. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Pull the pass on there. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going with the Vikings. <laughs> They're like, ah, keep rolling? Seven in a row. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a good one, folks, but I'm going to have to go with the Vikings. i got to mm. keep rolling. It's hard to see them with the eight in a kid. row, but mm. you just got to go with them. You know? Right. They just got to. I don't know the Falcons' injury situation. Devontae Freeman, Desmond Trafont. We'll find out, but I'm going Vikings. And the next game, Jackson's at Titans. Ooh. So Jackson's. Texans. <laughs> Jackson's at Jackson's. Titans. Okay. Uh-huh. Jackson's. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Houston. Ooh. Oh, I'm gonna go Houston. Um, Good. Yeah, I mean, I seem to always pick the Titans wrong, so we're just gonna continue that. So I'm gonna go Houston. You picked them last week. Did I pick they them almost, last week? They almost lost. Yeah, okay. You almost blew it for them. They. They. Always... I'll give you guys the win. Here you go. It's gonna be a close one, like always, but the Titans will win the game. Hmm. I just don't think Savage has it in him. Well, yeah, but yeah, it'll be close, but the Titans will win. He's got something in him. What? Nothing. Chiefs at Jets. Can the Chiefs figure it out? Like, what is going on? Nope. Nope. And a nope. Are the 2017 Chiefs the 2016 Vikings? It's looking like it. Except there's a big difference. The Vikings had 90% of their team hurt. The Chiefs aren't hurt. What are they doing? I don't know. I think they're just taking, like, naps or something. Right before the game? Right. I think too many naps. And milk. (laughs) And milk. That slows you down, yeah. yeah. I'm going to go with the Jets here. Ooh. I got a little upset alert happening, and I think uh, Jets had it last week, but it was kind of blown last second. But we know why the Jets will win this game. It's kind of obvious. By, by now, if you don't know it by now, you're lost. It's the intangibles of Josh McCown. Plain right. and simple. Right. Uh, I'm going to go with the Chiefs. Don't. Uh, everyone's been talking about, like, should they bench Alex Smith and bring Mahomes? Stupidity. I think, yeah, I think he's just going to ball out this game and get a win. I'm going with the Chiefs. Oh. I think they'll figure it out. Maybe they won't figure it out long term, like rest of the season, but they'll, they'll have a good game, I think. I think they'll mm. win. It might look like they figured it out. We'll see, though. I'm going Chiefs. Panthers at the Saints. Division matchup. Who you got? 8-3 and three versus 8-3. and three. I think there's a clear better team here. And I'm going to take the clear better team here, which is Nolan's. That's the better team? Yeah. I was talking about the – no, I was kidding. No, you were Yeah, I'm going to go up to Saints at home. Put up too many points. Panthers impressive, good record, but, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm not a believer yet. I'm not a believer. So, yeah, Saints. Broncos at Dolphins. What a terrible game. S- I think Simeon's starting? I think so. Yeah. Ooh. For that reason, give me the Broncos. Let's go. Yeah, I, there will I, be no chain snatching of any kind. Yeah, I agree with the Broncos as well. Yeah, I agree. I'm going with the Broncos as well. Hey, Should be a close one, but uh, they're both terrible. Lions at Ravens. The battle of six and five. <laughs> There's a much better six and five. <laughs> no, I don't know about that. Not both. much better. I'm going Lions. Stafford has his little little banged up ankle, but I think he figures it out. He's an actor. He likes if he didn't if he wasn't a football player, it'd be an acting. He would be an actor. You'd be a damn good actor. Wow. It's gonna be low scoring at first, you know, that's how the Lions do it. They they can't score. Mm -hmm. Uh, Ravens, they just can't throw the ball at all. Mm -hmm. 
But then all of a sudden, the Lions in the fourth quarter just come alive. Wait, we're going to be specific here. Marvin Jones is going to pull out two TDs yeah, out of nowhere. Come back, they'll come back and win the game, something with the Lions. Yeah, that, sound, that sounds about right. That's the breakdown. The Lions got a pretty easy schedule to finish that I noticed. So they might go on a streak here. They might get some... The Ravens might get some streaks in their pants. The Lions might get streaks mm. in their pants. We'll see what happens. This game is very important for both Maybe of them. One ugly mess. Yeah. Uh, Patriots at Bills. I think the Bills should go at Peterman. I think Bills going to win this one, but the right kind of Bill, and that's Belichick. I'm <laughs> that, was, that, that was confusing. <laughs> that was terrible. Okay. You're going with the Patriots. Patriots is out. Stop. Patriots. Stop. Yeah. Big time. And go with the Patriots. They're just much better. Oh, this next one. You'll like this next one. It is Niners at Bears. <laughs> All right, well. This is the game of the week. It has to be. Solomon Thomas versus Trubisky. Oh, boy. The ball game. And I think you already know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with the shocker here. This might surprise you guys. Put me down for the Bears. Bears at home. Okay. Yeah, I picked the Bears once this week or this year. And, uh, once. and they uh, lost. So, yeah, I'm going to go with the Niners. <laughs> All right, if Garoppolo plays, I like the Niners. If Bethard plays, I like the Bears. So what do you think? I think Garoppolo is going to play. I don't know. They said they're announcing it midweek, and it's almost there. We're almost there. Jimmy G Buckets plays, I got the In Niners. In his return to Chicago. His return to – Jimmy G's return to Chicago. No, it's not the same one. It works they're either both way. From Chicago. They're both from Chicago. Okay. The hometown kid. It should be – if you – I mean, if you don't care how bad the teams are, you just want his close game – well, there you go. Right. Turn it on. Yeah. It says CBS. Are they really playing or did they get switched to Fox? I don't know. what they're, the whole This year's all jacked up with that. Oh, they're really confusing me. I just hope that Vikings-Falcons game's on for me. That's all I care about. Hey. Next game. Oh. Buccaneers at Packers. Another fantastic one. Oh, God. Is Jameis playing yet or no? Is he's he eating a W? I don't know. He's got that W lodged in his throat. Is that why he's out? I think so. I think he's got some yeah, some W lodges. You know? Crab legs, maybe? I don't know. Maybe. They just keep him out the rest of the year. They're not going to make the playoffs. Get a good pick. <laughs> Give me the Hunleys. You want the Hunleys in that one? Yeah. yeah he played pretty well, even though they lost. He's got the lamest chin strip in the whole league. Packers in December at home. Hunley's yeah. chin strap. Should that be the name of this video? Yes. Okay. I'm going to go with the Packers. Yeah, I'll take the Packers. They, were, they played pretty good against the Steelers. They play anywhere near... That level, they ripped the Buccaneers. That was some high high octane. The, uh, the Buccaneers secondary is oh, high yeah. octane diarrhea. Let me tell you, that's spicy. Yeah, Colts at Jags is the next ball game division Ooh. matchup. I'm gonna go a little a little upset here. Give me the give me the Colts. Ooh. Oh wow. yeah, how's that? I hope so. I don't like the how's Jags that for an upset. I don't like the Jags. I don't really like, like the Jags. Like, you're <laughs> right about the Cardinals. Did we all pick the Cardinals no, over the pick, Jags? You picked the Jags. And you blew it. Yeah, I just that's why I'm I'm done with the Jags. I felt you pretty confident about that one. Gabbard over his old team and yeah. it worked out. You know, the, the Jags offense doesn't have Fournette has to go wild, which could happen. No. It know. could happen, but Bortles can't go wild. Yeah, Bortles. If you think Bortles can lead mm. this team Anywhere in deep in the playoffs, you've lost your mind. Defense just continues to be play very well, uh, but I don't know, Pete. Who you got? Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Jags. I really don't want them to win, but I think minus nine win. and a half. I think they'll get it. I think they'll get it done. Uh, the Jags might get seventy-two sacks in this game, so yeah. the Jags are gonna seventy-two, win. huh? That's it. Could be team. an NFL single-game record. It could be. It could be. I'm going Jags. Wow. We better keep – we got to get have a tracker on that. Well, what's the record? Oh, and, did they get like 12 against some of them earlier in the season? Oh, they did? Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. So we're – Brissett's mobile, and he gets sacked a shit ton because the Colts' offensive line is just terrible. Like T-Mobile? Uncontrollably terrible. Now, they probably can control it. They're they're just bad. You'll see. They need – I don't know. Browns at Chargers. As the Browns get their first win against the Chargers again, like last year. Is it a repeat? Right when the Chargers get hot? The return. The return of what? Josh Gordon. 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 Is he for sure playing? Yes. Oh, boy. And uh, give me give me the Browns. Ooh. Oh, wow. Give me the Browns. I, I'm actually <laughs> tempted, too. Just yeah. They got history. Third do. Everyone's, th- Everyone's so hyping cool. up the Chargers. Yeah. I can see them just blowing it so right out of hype. Yep, do it. Phillip Rivers is playing pretty well. Chargers though. are minus, minus 14. I would take the Browns in that game. And, and I'd, I'd put money on the Browns. I'm going to go with the Chargers, though. Yeah, I, I, I think it'll be a squeaker. I think the Chargers win. It's only the Jags. 
Yeah, only the Jags can have only a squeaker. Only the Jags can have a squeaker. But I didn't pick a squeaker this week for the Jags. I think they get, like, again, I think they get a, just a ridiculous amount of sacks. Just they got 12 last time on them. They might give about 14, 15 what's, this time. What's, like, the over-under on defensive touchdowns for the Jags? I say three. Three? Three. <laughs> Uh, I, was I, mean, put, I was up for that one and a half. That, I was about to say one and a half. Three. And we're going backwards. We just talked about the Browns Chargers. We went back right. to the Colts Jags. There's nothing talk- exciting about the Browns Chargers besides Gordon. It's, it's going to be it's exciting. exciting. It's Ben Gordon's it's cousin. Giants, Giants Raiders. Mm. Watch out for the Raiders winning that division. They don't sleep on the Raiders. People were overhyping the Raiders in the beginning, before this year, and I was not buying into it. But now I'm starting to think they could win that division. They got a free one here. Yeah. Don't you guys agree? Yeah, free, yeah. Not, free 99. Free 99 against the Giants. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it might not be a big win, but it should be a free win. Rams at the Cardinals. I think the Rams do some serious ramming here. Yeah. Serious. Like, yeah, I won't even get into it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to go with the Rams as well. I'll take the Rams. I don't think Gabbert's got two in a row. I don't think he's got a back-to-back. I don't think he's got that kind of fortitude. I'll let go back-to-back. Yeah. Yeah, uh, Eagles at the Seahawks. Who you got? Yeah, give me the Eagles. Uh, I think I don't know. They they barely beat the Bears, you know. So <laughs> <laughs> they got lucky. <laughs> they got lucky against the Bears. No, I'm gonna go Eagles. The, I think the Seahawks defense is too banged up. Mm. Enough said. Yeah, it's it's hard to see the Eagles go 11 one, but the Seahawks secondary is just. Just too beat up. Just ground beef. Yeah. Seahawks are beat up, but they're at home. The fans are going to want it. The players are going to want it. I think the Eagles are the better team, but just for the regular season, just for a, a weekly upset, I'm going with the Seahawks. Wow. Yeah, I did it, yes. Oh, wow, yeah, he did that. S- Steelers getting a third primetime game in a row. Is that what they played the Titans on Thursday night. Who are they, they playing over there? They played the Packers. Uh, now they're playing the, the Bagels. They're at the Bagels. They're not but the Bagels anymore. They got. They got. Oh yeah, yeah that was touchdown a touchdown. Yeah. yeah. So they're at Bengals. I guess. Right. Steelers at Bengals. What do you, what do you guys got? I'm taking um, taking the feelers here. Yeah. I think they just keep keep doing their little rolling action. Rolling. Scott rolling. Yeah, we'll maybe see. maybe closer than you think, but yeah. the Steelers win. Yeah, we'll go with the Steelers. Though. They're only minus five. Joe Mixon. They keep pounding Joe Mixon. And too he soon, will get yards. Soon. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is, right. Le- is Le'Veon gonna actually like have like a great game ever? He, might, well, he, I mean, combining rushing and receiving, he did pretty well last game. Yeah, but he needs to. He's not himself. Not himself. Something's going on. That'll do it for the week thirteen picks. Don't forget to click that fucking subscribe button and like the video. That'll do it. Bye. I said that'll do it a couple times. Yeah, bye. Bye. that'll do it. Goodbye.